Hello, you're watching another SEO content machine tutorial video. Today we're going to cover the usage of the article translator as applies to both the article creator and the article downloader. I've opened up an article creator task already and in front of me we have the rewriter translator tab. If you click on that, it's going to open up the article translator options. So you can both use the translator and rewriter at the same time for any content creation task. Simply what happens is the article translator is going to run first. It's going to translate your content into your target language. Then on that translated content, the article rewriter is going to run on top of that. It is therefore important that your article rewriter has the ability to process and rewrite content in the final language that you have chosen. We can enable the article translator by clicking on this toggle button here. Under translator services, you have the opportunity to use either Bing, DeepL, Google or Yandex. For each translator service, you have a different list of languages that you can use. Also note that Bing and Google as of the time of this recording do offer some free plans. If you do sign up, make sure that you enter your translator API details here on the right hand side where it says translator logins, otherwise your translations will fail. So once you've chosen your translation service and you've chosen the final language that you want your content to be translated into, it's just a simple matter of hitting the run or save button at the top right hand corner. 